welcome to ugc net and uh, gate computer science students so in today topic uh, okay i'll be uh, covering part 3 of uh, discrete structure and uh, optimization in uh, ugc net computer science uh, okay so here uh, i mean uh, i'll be discussing uh, okay what are the uh, problems may be asked in uh, june 2020 examination okay so you can uh, reach me uh, here if you have any doubt okay so i am going for a uh, okay content here okay so now i mean uh, in july 2018 uh, they were uh, asked uh, one of the question as uh, which of the relation on uh, i mean uh, uh, data element 0 1 2 3 is equivalent relation okay and uh, we need to know very simple uh, i mean definition of equivalence relation a relation said to be equivalence if it is satisfying a uh, reflexive symmetric and transitive okay so what is a uh, reflexive the element has to be i mean suppose uh, if i take uh, i mean uh, uh, pair of uh, element as a relation i mean zero related to zero then uh, i mean uh, it is said to be a uh, reflexive okay what is symmetry so if i have uh, for your example uh, if i have uh, 0 comma 2 then it must have 2 comma 0 okay then it is said to be uh, uh, i mean uh, symmetry so here uh, for this option we have 0 comma 2 then 2 comma 0 there so it is said to be uh, symmetric what is transitive so transitive uh, related to three or uh, i mean uh, content here right for example if i have uh, 0 comma 1 okay then 1 comma 2 then i should have 0 comma 2 okay so that is a db uh, uh, transitive okay so now if you are looking option one whether it is a uh, i mean uh, equivalent relation or not okay so i mean uh, here um, um uh, among uh, this uh, data element um here uh, in uh, element 1 is uh, missing okay so then uh, it is uh, not uh, uh, present so i mean for this uh, it is not uh, reflexive then uh, option 1 is uh, not uh, equal on relation if you are coming to option 2 so 0 comma 0 there 1 comma 1 there 2 comma 2 there 3 comma 3 there all are uh, be familiar with uh, what is called uh, reflexive okay but uh, what happen here is i can say 0 comma 0 okay itself uh, symmetric also okay so like that uh, here uh, transitive also present okay so why in the sense okay i can say okay um, i mean 0 comma 0 uh, will be repeated uh, three times so then it is a uh, i mean transitive okay so option a is a uh, equivalence relation and then option three in which what is missing so here um, i mean uh, it uh, fail for uh, reflexive okay so it means zero comma zero there and uh, one comma one there and uh, uh, 2 comma 2 is missing and uh, 3 comma 3 also missing okay so then uh, it is a to be uh, not uh, i mean equivalence relation if you are coming here uh, here also 3 comma 3 is missing okay so then we can easily conclude that option 4 also wrong okay so option b is uh, i mean option 2 is uh, correct answer okay okay so next question uh, is from november uh, 2017 so if the time is now four o'clock what will be time after uh, one at one hours from now okay so simply we can uh, do what okay so actually uh, we know 24 hours become one day and in one at one how many uh, 24 hours there four time okay which is uh, uh, 48 48 96 okay so now after that uh, uh, 101 minus uh, 96 is nothing but 5 hours okay simply you want to add uh, 4 o'clock with uh, 5 then it will be 9 o'clock okay very simple answer and uh, next one is uh, let uh, 
m equal to 3 1 3 to base 4 and n equal to 3 2 2 base 4 then uh, find the base 4 expansion of m plus uh, n ok so it is very simple uh, i mean addition we can do um, ok so uh, here uh, uh, 3 1 3 ok what is this equivalent uh, in uh, uh, i mean um, decimal and like that uh, 322 into uh, this decimal finally we are uh, converting it to uh, 113 so now this 113 is supposed to convert back to base 4 ok for that uh, we have to go for uh, division operation then you will be getting 1301 ok otherwise we can simply add uh, these two and get the answer because uh, we can have I mean 2 plus uh, 3 ok so now uh, your uh, base 4 supposed to have each and every digit as what 0 to 3 ok now we are getting 2 plus 3 equal to what 5 ok now we want to take 5 mod uh, 4 ok now remainder is 1 ok we are getting 1 as answer here ok so now this uh, um, I mean uh, quotient has to taken to next uh, position now in this again position we have uh, 2 plus 1 3 3 plus 1 4 ok now what happen 4 mod 4 equal to remainder is 0 I am keeping 0 as uh, answer then 1 is uh, quotient again uh, third uh, position is uh, 3 plus 3 6 6 plus uh, quotient is already 1 so now what happened that is 7 7 mod 4 equal to ok remainder is 3 now quotient is 1 so no more uh, positional value there I am keeping this quotient here so 1 3 0 1 ok so uh, both uh, logic is very correct ok whichever uh, very uh, efficient you can do ok so next uh, question is from uh, how many distinguishable permutation of letter in word banana are there okay what is distinguishable it should not repeated okay so now uh, total uh, i mean letter present in banana is uh, 6 okay divided by number of uh, repeated uh, letter so here b is occur one time one factorial and uh, n is uh, occur uh, 2 times two, 2 2 factorial and a is occur 3 times 3 factorial total which mean total number of uh, i mean letters that is in uh, uh, numerator and uh, divided by uh, repeated uh, letters in uh, denominator with uh, probability so we will be getting 6 pro, uh, say, i mean 6 factorial 720 and uh, this uh, 2 into 3 factor by 6 so if you are uh, i mean uh, making uh, division operation you will be getting 60 as answer okay so answer is 60 and uh, c is option okay and uh, next one is uh, from november 2017 consider the following uh, linear um, uh, LLB problem so they are asking to maximize the uh, I mean their uh, uh, I mean uh, either uh, maximize in the sense uh, surely it is profit ok subject to constraint 4x1 plus 6x2 less than or equal to 360 and 3x1 plus 0x2 less than or equal to 180 0x1 plus 5x2 less than or equal to 20 uh, I mean 200 and both x1 and x2 greater than or equal to 0 then solution of fellows using graphical solution technique ok so actually and you will be easily getting such a solution ok what you want to do here is uh, the following is uh, answer here ok so for example uh, you want to maximize this one so given there and we need to find out equations uh, uh, points for given equation okay so we already know this 4x1 plus 6x2 less than or equal to 360 in order to make it as a inequality and you and then you want to substitute if you substitute x1 as 0 now what happens 6x2 equal to 360 that is inequality and inequality into equality you want to do now one of the point we are getting as 0 comma 60 
like that if you are substituting x2 as 0 here what happen x1 equal to 90 okay so no, and then 90 comma 0 like that we have one more uh, equation uh, 3x1 plus 0x2 less than or equal to negative so already x2 equal to 0 then x1 is what okay so 60 okay so now we have only one point as per this uh, equation but previous equation have two point it will make line okay this will be only point okay now like the third equation 0x1 plus 5x2 less than or equal to 200 now what happened x1 if you are substituting already it is 0 now x2 equal to 40 okay so uh, again it will producing only point okay now you want to keep uh, I mean x1 as uh, I mean uh, horizontal uh, line and uh, y axis uh, as uh, x2 okay so now we are uh, we want to I mean not to get answer we need to uh, have the very proper uh, I mean uh, plain paper uh, graphical representation so we want to make it as equal uh, points uh, and 10, 10 uh, because we are getting point from 60 90 and all we can make as a unit as uh, un, I mean 10 10 20 30 up to 90 there they like that I can set uh, 0 I mean 10 to 60 here now uh, we have one one line as what uh, 0 comma 60 which means x1 is 6 uh, 0 and x2 is uh, x2 equal to 60 this point like that uh, uh, 90 comma 0 okay so this point we are drawing one line okay so next uh, for this uh, i mean 60 comma 0 60 comma 0 for that we are having one point okay like that uh, for 40 comma 0 having this line okay so which mean uh, uh, here uh, 60 comma 0 here okay so we have point this should be uh, draw vertical line like that here uh, I mean 0 comma 40 for that you have to draw one uh, I mean horizontal line okay now uh, which is uh, solution and uh, which point giving maximum solution that that is our task to find out so now uh, uh, this line and then this point uh, i mean uh, horizontal line this point vertical line all uh, lines as well as point common places said to be uh, peaceable solution uh, places in uh, graphical method in uh, operation research and um, uh, related concept okay so now I mean uh, so and also you want to note down uh, following things so this equation now less than uh, lesser and uh, equal to less than or equal to okay which means this line lower bound is solution area like that this also lesser than or equal to okay so for the two the I mean uh, the point is 60 comma 0 so this one which means this lower area not uh, I mean so from this uh, vertical line this lower area is nothing but uh, solution area not this area like that uh, this point for which this lower area which mean all i mean this one line two points its common area is uh, this one okay so now we are got uh, point as uh, we can uh, give name for this point a b c d okay so four find there and uh, uh, any uh, point may be giving uh, more uh, from it so i mean as per uh, i mean uh, here uh, we have uh, i mean maximize equation and that is a uh, 5x1 plus uh, 10x2 okay and so this point you know 60 comma 0 this point we know okay 60 comma 20 this point you know 30 comma 40 I mean this point we know 40 I mean 0 comma 40 okay whichever points we want to substitute in this particular maximize equation such a that if it is giving maximum that is our answer okay so now 60 x1 is 60 x2 equal to 20 that is the maximum profit it will give so the answer is 1100 okay so what they are asking they are asking what is the maximum profit and also what are the x1 and x2 okay so here uh, this uh, 60 uh, 20 1100 okay option b is right answer 
ओके सो नाउ डोंट गो विथ ब्लाइंड वे टू चूज मैक्सीम दैज थौस वन फिफ्टी ओके सो दिस मे नाट गेट फ्रम अवर आंसर सो यू वॉन्ट टू टेक केर ओके सो ओके and uh, next one is uh, okay i'll be teaching uh, rest of the question in next part thank you thank you for watching